As our alert day does wind down tonight, that rain is going to be coming to an end, but the ice was a really big deal through the course of today, especially up across southern Michigan, where we had mainly wet weather in the Toledo Metro. A few elevated surfaces to get a minor ice accumulation, but it did turn very icy in Michigan, and it will continue to be so into tomorrow morning. How about the rainfall? Could you imagine this? It was the fourth wettest all-time day in February's history. Those records go back into the 1870s. We topped over two in inches of rain and it rained very steadily much of the day and that was at a Toledo Express Airport and many other areas topping over two inches of rain as well. Here's where the ice was along north of the Maumee River as we expected it would be up into southern Michigan. Reports of several tenths of an inch of ice. We've had power outages. We've had some tree damage and we've had very poor travel, especially across southern Michigan. Poor travel going to be a concern into tomorrow morning. We've already got districts that are choosing to close. That is the beauty of that exclusive school delay hotspot map. We can see they're all in Lenawee County and we're looking up toward Sand Creek. We're looking over toward Blissfield up at Adrian and Tecumseh uh, all closed at this point. Four districts officially closed and perhaps more tomorrow morning as we see those buses uh, look to get out uh, early in the morning. Damp for most of us in Ohio. Icy spots are going to be confined mainly up into southern Michigan right around the freezing mark into the afternoon. Dramatically warmer. Windy with some sun. Highs are going to go jumping through the 50s. It could even get to the 60s south of of Toledo. A little bit of rain still to get through. A little bit of freezing rain up across southern Michigan. Vast majority of that is over with, though. We'll carry that ice storm warning until 4 a.m., but it may take some time for that ice to actually melt away as we go through the day tomorrow. We're very close to the freezing mark along and north of the Maumee River, but look at how much warmer it is. Central Ohio, they're in the 60s right now, and even a few spots who would have imagined in late February in the low 70s. The end of the rain and drizzle is going to be very quickly after midnight. Dry weather returns by tomorrow morning, but slippery spots. Icy conditions will persist across southern Michigan. We'll start to get that sun that returns as we go through a late morning or early afternoon. Winds will pick up, could gust 40 to 45 miles per hour, and then the warm up will take place. So it may take us some time to turn warmer. So areas across southern Michigan, you're still going to be in the 30s even at lunchtime upper 40s to mid to upper 50s far south and most areas reach well into the 50s could even see some low 60s south and east of Toledo for tomorrow afternoon mid 50s is what I'm going to call for mixed clouds and sun that breeze will be gusty from the 50s Thursday we tumble back to 30 on Friday more, mostly cloudy skies close to 40 for Saturday mid 40s on Sunday the weekend is looking dry next system comes into the area Monday and it is set to soak us again more rain Monday could even be heavier at times with highs and turning a bit cooler into early March. Dip it back into the low to mid 40s as we go through Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday of next week.